everyone, it's Rachel, and today I'm going to sit down and paint a haunted house figurine. Um, when I'm filming this right now, it's October 3rd, so I'm gonna have this done in time for Halloween. Um, I bought this at Target, I think it was $3, it might have been 5 I don't know, it was in that um, bargain section. So this is what it looks like right now, all plain, it's cute. And on the packaging, it provides like a look that you can go for. And I think I'm gonna try my best to replicate that look. However, if you saw my Christmas Eve um, vlog that I did, you know that I'm not very good at painting and I'm not very good at that type of thing. However, I have fun when I do it and that's what matters, right? So I have my whole setup here, I have some uh, Newspaper, I have the paints here. It came with these three paints and a little paintbrush. So I'm gonna use, I have a cup of water and I have a paper towel. So I'm all set to go. So this is what, it was $3. This is what the inspiration is. Uh, yeah. And I'm just gonna keep going and um, interject a little bit probably, um, but I'm also going to be watching some YouTube videos to help pass my time. It's 9.30 um, as I'm starting this, 9.29 a.m. And we're going to see how long this takes. So stay tuned.
Okay guys, it's 24 minutes into this video. It's 9.52 and I finally finished the purple, which was the first color I was working on. And um, safe to say that my painting skills have not improved any since the last time I tried this. So here's what the front looks like with just the purple. And here's the side with the ghosts, it's blue, and here's the roof. Yeah, safe to say that my painting skills have not improved any. Um, trying to debate if I want to, um, no, I should probably do the black first because there's black detailing on this that if I start to paint the whole house green, I'm going to miss. Oh, I missed some. The spider web in the corner is supposed to be purple. But I think I'll just... I think I'm just gonna do it black because I'm already soaking the paintbrush. So yeah, I guess I'm gonna go in and try to do the black now next and hopefully I don't completely ruin this figure. Oh. If, even if I do, I'm still gonna display it because like I paid money for it and I did it and I won it obviously, but um, yeah, my painting skills are uh, not the best, but that's okay. Um, yeah, so. Onward with the black. Clean your teeth, floss, don't follow my influence.
right, y'all, we're 48 and a half minutes into this. It's 10.16 right now, and I just finished the black. My paintbrush is soaking, and last thing that I have to do is fill in all the other gaps with the green, because green is the color of the house. Um, so I know you were able to see a lot more of this as I was going along with the black, but let me just show you what I did. Um, still haven't improved at all. So here's the the side with the spider web and the bat and the roof with the black and the purple uh, and the front the door and the bat and all the other spider webs as well and that's really it and it took me way too long to do that when there's not that much of it the purple is definitely lighter than I thought it was going to be but that's okay maybe with the green it'll pop um, also, only gotten a little bit of paint on my hands so far, which I would say is a plus. I also cannot feel my hands, and I'm almost three entire YouTube videos in. And when I say YouTube videos, I mean 10 plus minutes. And I have more to go because, y'all, I'm still catching up from when I did that show in July. I am so far behind on YouTube. I have a playlist of 200 videos that I need to watch. And then, um, if any of you guys watch Crink Gameplays, um, Ethan, uh, recently made public a lot of his old videos, so I made a special separate playlist of those, because originally I had them in and I was adding videos every day because I'm trying to watch things in chronological order. Um, so I'm so far behind on everything. The video I'm watching now is a video that was posted August 27th, and like I said, it's October 3rd. So I am clicking along, and I'm trying to catch up as quick as I can, and hopefully by the end of the month, I'll be current. But, uh, we'll see. So I'm gonna, um, soak my brush a little bit more. Because it's black, it's gonna take a little bit longer. I might have to actually run it under the sink. Because I don't want any of the black to mix with the green. So, let my brush do its thing, go back to watching my video, and then uh, finish painting the house. And hopefully we can get this done in under two hours. So, check back in with you in a little bit. Dial me there. I'm going to link the Etsy shop down below. Check them out.
right it's now an hour and uh, almost 10 minutes in and I'm finished as much as can be um, I ran out of the green paint so some of it's a little patchy but it is what it is and it's just supposed to be like a fun little project I wasn't going for anything professional I did end up with a little bit more um, paint on my hands but that's what happens when you craft right so I'm gonna show you the finished product uh yeah so here's my little house the side the other side the back in the front so this is gonna be something cute that i put on my shelf um and take out for holidays um a few years ago i painted a nativity set for um the christmas season so it's just something that i would like to do um and again i never claimed to be good at these types of things I'm a lot, I don't know what that is. It's like a weird light spot. I don't know. Um, I never claimed to be good at uh, these types of things. I'm a lot better at scenic painting than I am any, oh, I bet it's my webcam. I'm a lot better at scenic painting than I am, am anything else, and I'm not even fantastic at that, but I can get by enough because uh, 20 foot rule. So, uh, yeah, thank you so much for watching this. Um, I might be doing more of these in the future. I might be getting more ceramic type things and just decorating them because it's relaxing. I'm not very, I'm not the best, but you know, it's relaxing and it's something to keep me um, occupied and focused. And actually for a while there, I even forgot that I was filming and I was just so in the zone. I was listening to YouTube videos, which um, is relaxing to me in and of itself, and uh, yeah, I was just focused in the zone, and it was something I really enjoyed. So hopefully you guys like this type of video, and if not, um, I, I know I, I do have more crafting videos coming up that I am actually prepping for today. I tried to finish prepping yesterday and it didn't quite happen. So depending on how long it takes me to finish the prep, it is a little bit of a longer prep and I was going to film it, but then the video would have ended up being like six hours long. So I'm just, I'm, I'm going to do the prep alone and then the actual craft I will film. Um, so that's coming and I have a couple sewing projects that I think I'm going to do and um, there's a Thanksgiving craft one that I will do, and I told the dogs out real quick, so one second. <sighs> Alright, clear in now. I just like really watch them close because Taz is looking for my sister who's away right now, and he will jump our porch and run away, <laughs> which is great. I actually did chase them already earlier today. So like I said, I have a lot of uh, crafting videos on the way and more planned. I also have more casual videos planned. Um, Vlogtimber wasn't a complete success, but well, well um, life happens and a lot of stuff came up. And I was actually sick for a majority of September and working a lot. And it was just, there was just a lot going on. So, um, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in another video. Bye!